Hey guys, so I know I just did my December favorites. I was just in the mood to get those videos done with. To just, you know, swipe them out of my list. So, list? So, enough with that said. Um, let me, I'm super excited to show you guys these products. I don't know, I want to talk a lot. So, let's just drive right in. Because when I see these videos, I just want to show me what you got and talk about it. So, the first thing that I'm going to be talking about is going to be a primer. And I know um, a lot of people rave about this. For me, it has to be my favorite 2014. Yes, yes. Um, and this one is the Professional Pro Ball Minimize by Benefit. This one absolutely changed my life when I got this one. Um, because I do have pores that I want to cover throughout my face. I will not say that I use it all over my face because I did use it at times and I honestly did not see a good or bad on it um, I did feel that it did dry up my skin a little bit when I used it all over my face so that is why I you know this is just I'm not gonna say this has been my best primer for my whole face because I have not virgin to that I haven't indulged in finding what primer is the best for me either it's high-end or drugstore so I'm going to say this has been my best primer for little spots here and there that I have throughout my face. But if you have, you know, if you want to try it for your whole face, you know, by all means try it. But for me, it does not work. It just works for little spots that I have here and then that pores I just want to cover. But it has been a holy grail for me. I have loved this one and I'll keep on loving it. But I am going to indulge in 2014. 2015 to find the perfect primer for my face so keep an eye for that because I'm super super excited for that so yeah okay so and the next thing that I have would be foundation and I'm not going to show you the specific foundation for my 2014 because I have two I have the covergirl 3-in-1 foundation and I do have the covergirl ready set gorgeous um, but I'm going to say for the month of, for the month of, for the year of 2014, the brand of foundation that I've loved throughout the year has to be CoverGirl. Either it is, you know, whatever it is, the 3-in-1, the Cover, Ready, Set, Gorgeous, whichever one. I haven't ventured into other ones. I don't think there's other ones. Well, there is, but I've tried them. And CoverGirl for me is just holy girl brand. I've loved it from the beginning since I was young and, you know, but I'm ready to, like I keep saying, indulge into more, explore into more foundations and stuff like that. But holy grail has to be cover girl. It's going to be these two. And I've, if you see my December favorites, it has to be the L'Oreal True Match. This one, holy girl, again. This is just lightweight. It covers what it needs to cover. It just, I've loved it throughout the summer, the spring, the winter, and the fall. Let's just put it like that. I've loved it. Another holy girl for me has to be the Maybelline Age Rewind. This one is just amazing. Amazing. That's all I have to say. Um, okay, so the next thing that I'm going to go into will be, I guess, eyeshadows. Holy grail for the 2014. I started using this at the end of 2014, but I know I would have loved it the same at the beginning of the year. has to be this color by Milani. I just loved it. This color is Bella Ivory. A one holy grail holy grail this amazing amazing color um, pigmentation soft satiny just like how I like my ashes another holy grail for me for 2014 has to be my chocolate bar palette all these colors I've used them in some sort of way and these colors have been amazing amazing the pigmentation on these the smell Ooh. and the satiny the and so the next thing I'm gonna speed this up a little bit has to be this powder stay matte um, by Rimmel London. I've loved it. I've used it so many times throughout the summer, especially. Has to be stay matte powder that I love throughout the 2014 year. Loved it, loved it, loved it. It has been my favorite. Another thing that I have is going to be this master highlight by Face Studio by Maybelline Highlight Bronzer. Loved it throughout everything. I just loved it, loved it so much. The pigmentation, the color, everything is perfect about that. The next thing I'm gonna go in with lipsticks. Like I mentioned in my 
December favorites, excuse the sun. Like I mentioned in my December favorites, it has to be this Carmax. And then for lipstick, um, it has to be this one, Holy Grail. It is a nude color, and this is in the color number 14 by Brimmel London Kate Edition, or Kate, um, Kate Moss. Um, line and it's just been holy holy grail for me I've used it throughout the summer throughout the fall throughout everything for 2014 the next thing for me has to be mascaras and Ooh. okay so the next thing for me has to be mascaras okay let's go with liquid liner liquid liner I've been loving has to be line stiletto I've been loving it for about three years already and it is just amazing I cannot rave about this so much a lot of people use it and stuff and holy grail for 2014. Next thing we're gonna go in mascaras. From the normal brand or drugstore brand, I have the Clump Crusher from CoverGirl. Amazing, amazing brush. I just I've been loving it so much. And use it throughout the whole month. I mean the whole year. Then another one is going to be the better than sex mascara. I've just loved it so much for high-end brand. It has to be Too Faced better than sex mascara okay and then the last thing we have is going to be um my max fix lips i've used this so many times i started using it in other ways at the end of december so i'm super super pumped for my max fix lips and i've had it for a while and as you can tell it's still going strong so i've loved it great purchase and yeah so those are all my favorites for the 2014 year. I am super excited to show you guys these products because I am going to be exploring and um, trying out different products and different type of makeup. Like my concealers, I'm going to explore and search into different ones just to see which is better and stuff like that. And as well as brighteners, um, eyeshadows, foundations. So I'm super, super excited to show you guys all the favorites of 2014 as well as introduce to you new ones. So with that being said, I hope you enjoyed my video. Hope you enjoyed my products. I've been rambling. I haven't been on in a while. So I'm a little awkward, I guess. I do not know why. But either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Have any questions, suggestions, or any comments, just leave them down below. And I will get back to you guys. I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. And yeah. Hey guys, and then another thing I wanted to mention, if you want me to recreate any of the looks that you've seen in the my blogs or videos or chit chats that I've had with you, just let me know down below by commenting and also liking the video, you know, just so I know that, or just comment down in the description bar just to let me know that you guys want me to recreate any of my, any of the looks that I've been wearing and stuff like that. So yeah, just let me know. And I'm watching Kangaroo Jack, so that's why you hear noise. But yeah, that was awesome. I hope you guys are having a lovely day, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys.